I bet. It's pretty easy. Okay, it's 3.45 on the 9th of June, Water Tribes Ridge Runner, and I are headed up to St. Mary's River just to have a little look around. We've launched from Traders Hill, which is a couple hundred yards behind me. Tide's kind of low now, still going out. And the river is low, as I understand from a local, uh, from, from a rain and general level standpoint. This is about a mile and a half, not quite, from Traders Hill on the St. Mary's. Just about five and a half miles upriver from Traders Hill now. The river is well, a while ago, I guess it was 100 feet wide. It may be a little less than that now. And the water is deeper now, but it was for a while uh, just about two feet deep. But nice and clear, despite being stained, it was very clean looking water. You can see the bottom at three or four feet easily. Excuse me? Even up here in the shade might be a good spot. Yeah, that, that seems very good. We're going to 
pull in and take a little break. We're just about 6.8 miles upriver from Traders Hill now, and the river's getting narrower. Still quite pretty. There have been some houses along the river, or not houses specifically, but signs of uh, docks and some picnic areas, and maybe houses further back we couldn't see them. But it's a very beautiful part of the river in here. Run out of water? Yep. Still got the squeaking pedal. Water's only about, it's less than a foot deep here. I don't think my camera's going to clear the obstacle here. It's certainly moving through 7.7 .7 nautical miles, and we've come to a place where we have to drag. We've just got a couple inches of water. It's still beautiful. The nature of the river's kind of changed. More exposed uh, sand on the sides, and uh, much less water flow. We've got some kids swimming in a old-fashioned swimming hole up ahead. <laughs> 